injured with the Pelicans, but he's kind of been in and out of that starting lineup. This team is trying to find this river. Pelican. But those are great looks for Conley. Ball to his right, back to his left. Slips inside, pulls the trigger. About a 10-footer good. It's his game. He's been doing it a long time, the mid-range. Takes his time, is very poised when he comes off the pick and roll. The dime. Step back, Chris Paul. And that's been the story, not only along with the painted area. Kucevic <laughs> has now started 0 for 5 despite the shot attempts. Paul got in. Just stood his ground and took the contact in his chest area. Paul oh, Nippy moves somehow. The guys start to lick their wounds and get ready for the next one. Oh! Oh, Paul! Again, Paul to stop the action. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So he could uh, head over to the bench. Oh, the left hand that Megan. And what you like. Just a dynamic player off the bench. Well, that's the first part is accepting the role and just thriving in it. Right now he's on the court with Paul. He turned around. I saw the go bear on back. Ooh. Yeah. That's just not. The Thunder got to get it inbounded here. 17 seconds. Paul steps back, guarded by Davis. Little stutter step. Got to the rim. Scoop. Over that hill. And, 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 and you know, they've gotten the lead here with plenty of time to go. You're the Thunder. You have to make your move now. Paul shakes Millsap beautifully, but couldn't finish. Now he can. Competitive as ever. Get Paul Millsap dancing. He gets Paul Millsap reacting. The wherewithal to get into that mid-range and then just hang tough. And what Billy Donovan, these... That's what you have to do to town. You have to just make him feel pressure. Paul floats it up. Off back iron. Offensive rebound. DJ McCollum. Averaging over 20 points per game for the fifth consecutive year. As Paul floats it. Here comes Paul pushing pace. Giftily into the paint. And flips it in. Tough shot. Felt like they had advantage, so he presses the issue. Doesn't matter where he's at. Ball hangs strong. Adams trying to move his feet to avoid picking up his fourth personal foul. He's only played 11 minutes. Here is Paul. So we open up this second quarter. Chris Paul got to his spot. Paul trying to turn the corner. Went into the body. Here is Paul with four seconds left. Paul on the drive, got hit, and banks it in! Wizardry from CP3. So prior... Final couple of seconds. They leave Paul alone. Under half time here with under five seconds. Paul double teamed, heaves it from half court. Three seconds, you have 4.3 seconds. This is gonna... Pull up for the three, and... That's kind of execution. So many times you see this, folks. This is why you got to always run this, because you never know. Trying to gain as much time as possible. Got it up the floor. He's going to have to make something happen here. Puts it up. Fading away. Oh, and he got See what Paul decides to do here. It's under five. Take that step back. Yeah. Two on three, and now Paul has some help. Surveys. Paul. Jitters. Takes. You can Plus the foul. Chris Paul asserting himself in this. His bag, whether it be the shooting, the driving, the dishing, tough step back shot, got fouled. And that's going to be a steal by Chris Paul. That's the second time he's stolen the ball on the end. Chris Paul. Vucevic is there. Paul backs it out. Shot clock is at five. Paul. Tough step back from the... But Philly has kind of slowed down the three-point shooting as the attempts have slowed down as Paul comes... Now Sabonis is on it. Is that legal? <laughs> He'll take it. He just throws you so many... As we open up go, go, quarter go, go, number go, go, go. two. As Paul... Adams wanting to get rid of it. Hands it off to Paul. All of his momentum fading. This Denver Nuggets team. The face of this Denver Nuggets team. How far will those two guys take them? Paul Heil. And these are the two teams that have been absolutely outstanding in the clutch. When you got an all-star bid, you average over 20 points per game. At some point, you're going to get yours. Paul. Has the 
mismatch. Can drive, can step back, wants the shot. And on the other end, attack them. All looking for some space, fading away, and he got it. Noel takes a tumble. They, they do that passing, Murray and Jokic, sometimes without very much spacing, don't they, Ryan? They do. Oh, got double teamed momentarily. Series of moves, he's got crossover, got him. It's just basically a pass out to Gallo. CP looking for a screen, got down low, free throw line. That just blocked the shot there. Defense by position on the ground. Oh. Throwing to those layups at the rim. His number's gonna get better. Chris Paul. Paul does not use the screen. Down low. Series of moves. Will he start this dribble again? Final minute. Wow. Chris Paul from the free throw line. The nine-time All-Star. Good, good seasoning here for Lonnie. Paul over Pirtle. As the Thunder team wearing the City Edition uniforms. Paul into the mid-range. Paul has been the answer. Fears, fades, and we put his imprint on the game here. With plays like that. Stepping in for Danilo Gallinari tonight, getting that start. And that's how weak side should work. They fall. One of those possessions is unfortunate for the Celtics. They just weren't meant to make a basket on <laughs> Blake. <laughs> that's sweet. We talked about before the game, one of the Really one of the key words that he used was wanting his Thunder using more force on both ends of the floor, winning at the point of... Well, they're going to play half-court pick and roll, old school, with CP3 orchestrating things. And of course, he's got a man on his back for the step back. The floor of the game back from the Spurs. San Antonio blew a 23-point lead last night in Denver. As Paul... There's a screen by Muscala. Same play this time, Paul... After four or five passes. Paul, nifty move. Right. Got around Rubio. Steps back and there. You just got to continue to go at him. There's Paul. We'll see what happens on the first cut. Paul. The grinding fadeaway. Got to the free throw line, holds up. Bad either. It was a musical version. Well, they both were musicals, I guess. That'll be shot by Chris Paul. Chris Paul. Terrific reading that play. Paul may... See what Paul does here. We'll take the three with... Shot clock, now at three. Paul, forced out, off the dribble, takes the throw. Free throws has led to this last possession of the game. Three seconds. Ball free. He is the glue. You're right, he's right. Unit. Yeah, and it's created something really dynamic. Like I say, this is a really, really solid basketball team. To stand to Williams gives you big, physical, strong defender, but also allows some versatility. Ball pressed out to be on the three-point line. Pulls up. And just continue to move the ball. Ball trying to shake and bake and shed Capellan. Against the Trailblazers, that was his high of the season. He's trying to break that here today. He's gonna shoot it over. Got a fresh 24 to go to as well. This ball, nice spin, fades and got dig down deep defensively once again. Paul turns the corner. Paul takes E. Dort gave it right back where it came from. Paul takes the bump, drop. So his own here, his first made shot. Paul breaks down the defense. Ball against Bryant. Set on the shot clock. Chris Paul to the reverse. And he gets his 11th rebound of the game. Phenomenal. Don't you agree with that? Paul on Napier. Nifty move. Got to the rim. Scores. Defense. They're getting their points now in transition. Paul. Oh. Oh. Which you probably won't hear the rest of the year. How did he not know that his shorts were off? He was a rookie. Oh, it's a right. Has the ball in the middle of the break here, watching Gallinari throws it up himself. 